again. My name is Gabe Zolna. This is the evening of the 18th of February, 2019. Article posted by ABC News. California AG, at least 13 states suing over Trump's national emergency. Quote, the president does have broad authority, but he doesn't have authority to violate the Constitution. Xavier Bacara said on Monday. You see a photograph of that worthless governor? California Attorney General Xavier Bacara Wright with Governor Gavin Newsom has sued the president dozens of times. Trump should sue California for that $3.5 billion, you know, for that failed rail program. <clears throat> California and a dozen other states. I wonder if those other states are blue states. <laughs> are filing a lawsuit challenging Donald Trump's national emergency declaration. California Attorney General Xavier Bacara said Monday, quote, the president admitted that there's not a basis for the declaration. He admitted there's no crisis at the border. He's now trying to rob funds that were allocated by Congress legally to various states and people of our states, Bacara told Andrea Mitchell on MSNBC Monday afternoon. Quote, the separation of powers is being violated. We're going to go out there and make sure that Donald Trump cannot steal money from the states and people who need them since we paid the taxpayer dollars to Washington, D.C. to get those services, he said. How about the $3.5 billion, huh? When are you guys going to give that back? Trump said on Friday that he would bypass Congress by declaring a national emergency to build a border wall along the nation's southern border after a protracted battle in which Congress has repeatedly declined to give the president billions to build border barriers. You know whose fault this all is? It's Trump's. You know why? Because he allowed the Democrats to take control of Congress. If Trump would have been watching ZolnerReport.com, and if he would have done half of the things that I recommended, he wouldn't be in a mess that he's in. Which is why I believe it's all done by design. But that's a different story. A national emergency declaration gives the president special powers to take taxpayer dollars from other budgets to pay for border wall construction. But legal challenges to such an effort are inevitable. Before the emergency was declared, Becquera vowed to reject this foolish proposal in court the moment it touches the ground. And the quotes, quote, the president does have broad authority, but he does not have authority to violate the Constitution, Becquera said. Hey, Becquera, how many times have you and that worthless governor of yours violated the Constitution, huh? President Obama never did this. He never tried to rate accounts. He didn't, huh? What did he tell General Motors shareholders? Just kiss your stock goodbye, they're worthless, huh? What did he do? Huh? He turned General Motors into China Motors. He turned Chrysler Motors into Fiat Motors. And who paid for that? The taxpayers. Stop with the bullshit, all right? How about Obamacare? How many billions of dollars went into that slush fund? President Obama never did this. My ass, he never did this. He never tried to rate accounts. He didn't have to. He had, he had Congress. He had Pelosi give him all that he wanted. And he also had that worthless speaker, Paul Ryan, give him all that he wanted. Funding accounts have been allocated by Congress. When a president tries to do that, the Supreme Court will typically step in and say, keep your hands out of the cookie jar. But Kara has sued the president dozens of times already, and the president signaled that he expected this lawsuit during his Friday remarks. And I'll sign the final papers as soon as I get into the old office. And you will have a national emergency, and then we will then be sued. And they will sue us in the Ninth Circuit. Even though it shouldn't be there, Trump said, speaking of the largest circuit court. It's actually a circus court. The Ninth Circus Court. Circus, not circuit. 
which includes California, and we will possibly get a bad ruling, and then we'll get another bad ruling, and then we'll end up in the Supreme Court, and hopefully we'll get a fair shake, and we'll win in the Supreme Court just like the band. Yeah? How long is that going to take? Huh? What, four or five years? New Jersey, Colorado, and Connecticut all confirmed to NBC News that they are part of the lawsuit! Let me see now, New Jersey, left wing, blue state. Colorado, left wing, blue state. Connecticut, left wing, blue state. Did I call it or what? The only national emergency is the president's trafficking in lies and deceit. Connecticut Attorney General William Tong said in a statement, William Tong, does that sound like an American? Huh? Oh, he might be an American. Sounds to me like he's Tong Tong. That's not like, you know, Smith or uh, Tong. Wouldn't that be like uh, Oriental? Who the hell knows? The whole thing's a joke. Like I said, this is all Bokuko Theater. It's all designed to distract, divert, to deceive. It's all bullshit. There's something else going on that they don't want us to focus on. And we're going to find out. And when we find out, none of us will be happy. You think not? Well, think what you like. Folks, I've been doing this for seven years. I don't need to see a lot to be able to know a lot and to be able to say a lot. Get it? Good. Thanks for listening. You might want to repost this in all your social media accounts. Pass along to your like-minded friends. Don't bother sending a copy to Trump. He won't look at it and he won't see it. Which is too bad.